What up everyone? Welcome back to the Murphy Lawn Care Channel. So today's video is not going to be too long. If you haven't already noticed, this eye is pretty messed up. Um, we had 10 properties on the schedule today. Two of those I was going to do a video of. Um, the first property was uh, mow slash leaf cleanup. Second property is pretty much a mow. Um, crazy. We still have grass growing pretty crazy here in North Carolina. Like Not like summer or spring, but like a lot more than it should be for how late we are in the year. Um, and then the second one was a mow and leaf cleanup. And we've got a lot better at leaves this year. Like, I just want to say that. Like, I'm really proud of me and Pop. Like, we've got a lot better at leaves this year. Last year, we really struggled, but we also went into it with completely the wrong equipment. I hadn't really done that this year, but on the third property, we did a leaf cleanup. Um, I bagged them with the grass catcher on the Bradley, um, dumped them in the woods, and then what little bit it would blow out under the deck, I couldn't get in the grass catcher. I took the 580 BTS, blew the property off. It looked amazing compared to what it looked like when we got there. There's still always going to be some residual leaves because they are still falling. Um, I was good. Everything was okay. I packed the trailer up. Everything was fine. I got in the truck um, and didn't even get like maybe an eighth of a mile down. I didn't even leave the neighborhood yet. And I felt something sharp get me in the eye. And um, it... I couldn't get it out of my eye. Um, I took a bottle of water, um, which Pop had drunk out of, and I probably have pink eye now. Like, my eye's probably infected. <laughs> like, I know that sounds kind of bad, but, like, did you drink out of it? He's like, yeah. I'm like, I don't even care at this point. I need that bottle of water. Like, I got to get this out of my eye because I could feel it cutting as I would blink. Um, and uh, so I tried washing my eye out. Nothing helped. Um, we decided to get, you know, get back to my house where we could have my wife look in my eye and possibly get whatever it is out with a Q-tip. She couldn't see anything. She said she didn't see any damage to my eye. Um, it's different when you get to the hospital. They have procedures to see things that we can't see. Um, we decided after I, I went and got a shower, washed my eyes out in the shower, nothing. It just kept getting worse. Um, and I wear glasses. Like, they sit pretty close to my face. But when it's really dusty, like, we get dust on our face. It just is what it is. There's really no way of avoiding getting dust in your eyes unless you wear goggles. Uh, I don't know too many people that wear goggles. You know, just saying. This is something, this is just this happens. Uh, anyway, we got to the hospital. Uh, they put the dye in my eye, hit me with a black light. He said that I had a severe abrasion um, on the top of my eye. He said he didn't see anything still in my eye. Good chance that it already came out, what I was feeling from the abrasion. And then right before he stopped, he said, hold on a minute. Took a Q-tip, and it looked like a small rock had got in my eye. Um, it is to the point I would be willing to say I have 50% vision in that eye right now. It's it's pretty tore up. i got to make an appointment with an eye doctor. Uh, we don't know what all its damage it's done. Hopefully, it's just the fact that it swelled up once again. I washed my eye out with water that it had already been drinking out of. Um, so that's not something you should do, but at the same time, like desperate times, Come for desperate measures. Um, I don't pack a lot of fluids in the truck during the fall. I really don't need that much when it's cool versus when it's hot. Uh, it's pretty easy days, and they get shorter too. Uh, which I had a pack Gatorade, which you couldn't flush my out Gatorade. I'm not a big water fan. Um, that's really the only clean water that I had in the truck. We are going to put a jug in there that we're going to change out every week or every two weeks, uh, just in the event something like this happens again to me or Pop. But either way, it really didn't solve the problem. Um, but in the future, it may be something that could have solved the problem or could solve the problem. So it's good to have. Um, but it kind of sucks because we got like nine properties that still need to get done um, for this week. And I can't do them. Um, so that's why there's not going to be a video dropping this week. I was actually excited about dropping. I just got really excited because I just realized I had a ghost energy just chilling. I didn't even realize I had this in here. That's awesome. It's like my favorite flavor electric lemonade you ever never had this it is awesome uh, but anyway uh, i was really excited about doing those videos this week really let down that i didn't get a chance i'm hoping this clears up by tomorrow i'm gonna get a couple properties done i've already i got some other things going on tomorrow so we've already got a list of the people that we are going to cancel pretty much either way uh, we're gonna message those tomorrow and then hopefully i can get at least two or three done tomorrow um 
yeah, it's it's been a rough day. Uh, so just wanted to kind of give you guys an update. Um, there's not gonna be a video, like an edited video this week. I'm really upset about that. Like I really wanted to get that done. I, I really enjoy making those videos. Um, uh, I do have a place where I plan on making one um, still. Um, and uh, yeah, just wanted to give you guys an update. Uh, anyways, been Murphy Lawn Care Channel. If you like the video, I don't know if there's anything to like, but give it a thumbs up guys, subscribe definitely because we're gonna have some awesome content coming. Really sorry this happened. Um, you know, when you do stuff like this, anything can happen. Um, I'm not sure what that is. My daughter wanted it, I bought it. It's that thing right there. My daughter wanted it at Goodwill. And uh, so I bought it. Or actually, I was in the process of buying it at the cash register. She, she decided that she didn't want it. But I bought it anyway because we were already up there and I wasn't going to be bad to put it back. But anyways, guys, this has been the Murphy Lawn Care Channel. That thing might be possessed. I really don't know. <laughs> Anyways, catch you guys next time.